welcome to our worship. We come into this space as people blessed by the touch of God, as people enriched by culture born into and discovered, as people wounded by racism, as people yearning for healing, as people working for the kingdom. God be with us. We come into this space with anticipation of the work before us, with an openness to discovery, with a commitment to working for reconciliation, with a willingness to challenge and be challenged, with anticipation of discovery. Christ, come near us. We come into this space to spend time with the scriptures, to learn about prejudice, to become aware of privilege, to explore cultures, to encourage each other to action. Holy Spirit, bless our time together. Amen. O oh Lord, you have searched me and known me. You know when I sit down and when I rise up. You discern my thoughts from far away. You search out my path and my lying down and are acquainted with all my ways. Even before a word is on my tongue, O oh Lord, you know it completely. You hem me in behind and before and lay your hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me. It is so high that I cannot attain it. For it was you who formed my inward parts. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Wonderful are your works that I know very well. Search me, O God, and know my heart. Test me and know my thoughts. See if there is any wicked way in me and lead me in the way everlasting. Let us pray. O Lord, you created us as equal, yet we have treated one another unjustly. Forgive us, O God. You created us in your holy image, yet we failed to recognize the dignity and sacredness of your image in every person. Forgive us, O oh God. Some of the old wounds of injustice are still bleeding, and the callousness of our scars prevent us from being more sensitive to others as we ought to. Heal us, O oh God. Help us that we may listen to those to whom injustices have been done while we hear your cry in theirs and feel your pain in theirs. Help us, O oh God. As the new, tender skin emerges from under the old scars, create in us a new humanity through the brokenness of our experiences. Create in us, O oh God, a new humanity. That we may celebrate together the dignity and sacredness of humanity in one another for the sake of your glory. For the sake of your glory. Amen. A reading from Colossians 3 verses 12 to 17. As God's chosen ones, holy and beloved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, meekness, and patience. Bear with one another, and if anyone has a complaint against another, forgive each other, just as the Lord has forgiven you. So you also must forgive. Above all, clothe yourself with love, which binds everything together in perfect harmony. And let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts, to which indeed you were called in the one body, and be thankful. Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly, teach and admonish one another in all wisdom, and with gratitude in your hearts, sing psalms, hymns, and spiritual songs to God. And whatever you do, in word or deed, do everything in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, giving thanks to God the Father through him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God.
the Holy Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to St. John. Glory to you, Lord Jesus Christ. When he had gone out, Jesus said, Now the Son of Humanity has been glorified, and God has been glorified in him. If God has been glorified in him, God will also glorify him in himself and will glorify him at once. Little children, I am with you only a little longer. You will look for me, and as I say to the Jews, so now I say to you, where I am going, you cannot come. I give you a new commandment, that you love one another, just as I have loved you you also should love one another. By this, everyone will know that you are my disciples, if you have love for one another. The Gospel of Christ. Pray to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Let us join together in saying the affirmation of faith. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind, and with all your strength. This is the first and great commandment. The second is like it. Love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. Let us pray. For the indigenous peoples of Canada, the first to offer hospitality to newcomers in this land, we thank you. And we ask, O oh God, hear our prayer. For migrants, refugees, and strangers in our midst, we pray that they may find hope in our concern for justice and feel the warmth of the Creator. We pray and say, O oh God, hear our prayer. For our politicians and leaders, that they may find way to treat immigrant and refugee with justice, celebrating the gift brought into our communities. We pray saying, but you entendez notre prière for migrant workers, immigrant refugees, and all newcomers, that they may be welcomed into our communities. We pray saying, oh Dios, escucha nuestra oración. For our community gathered here today to celebrate our unity and that we may come to greater understanding and acceptance of our differences. We pray saying, O oh God, hear our prayer. For those of us who are overwhelmed by loneliness, poverty, and despair, that they might be comforted through assistance and kindness, we pray saying, O oh God, hear our prayer. For those with special needs, that the Holy One in his mercy may heal the ill, comfort the dying, and keep those still traveling safe to their destination. We pray, saying, We gather all these prayers and those tucked away so deep in our hearts that they are only visible to you, and we lift them to you as we pray. Amen gathering our prayers and praises into one. Let us say together as our Savior taught us. Our God in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial 
and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Good and gracious God, who loves and delights in all people, we stand in awe before you, knowing that the spark of life within each person on earth is the spark of your divine life. Differences among people are multicolored manifestations of your light. May our hearts and minds be open to celebrate similarities and differences among our siblings. We place our hopes for harmony in our committed action and your presence. May all peoples live in peace. Amen. Friends, we have come from the far corners of the world to create this community of faith. So welcome as you have been welcomed. Love as you have been loved. And go from this place knowing you are never alone. For you go with God, the source of all love. Jesus, the love incarnate. And the Holy Spirit, the love's power. And now may the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be upon you this day and remain with you always. Amen.